Hello comic book fans out there, Civil War 2 issue number 4 has recently come out and holy crap, finally the big action is about to start. Quick recap, there's an inhuman by the name of Ulysses who's capable of seeing a possible future. Captain Marvel aka Carol Danvers has decided to use him to try to prevent disasters. But in doing so, she's also inadvertently caused the death of a couple different Avengers, including War Machine and the Hulk, also known as Bruce Banner. So obviously this is causing a rift among the superheroes. More so with Tony Stark because number one he's really upset that his best friend died but he's also wondering whether or not Ulysses abilities are true and in this issue we find out that Ulysses abilities are only 10% accurate there's a whole lot of scientific stuff that's put in there but the whole gist of it is that he's only right 10% of the time She-Hulk was put into a coma at the very beginning of this series by Thanos she's just now finding out that her cousin Bruce Banner was killed and that his killer was Hawkeye he was tried and found not guilty I'm sure that's not gonna come to bite him in the ass later on. Sarcasm. This ends off on a huge note where I literally, not figuratively, I literally yelled out loud, oh, it's about to happen. I won't spoil what that is, but when I saw it on panel, I was like, oh my god, this was awesome. I can't wait to see how this is going to be played. So some people aren't too happy with the build up to this series, but I'm actually very happy with it. I feel like this has progressed fairly well. And in the next issue, a major epic battle is going to be taking place. It's something that I can't wait to see. David Marquez's artwork is phenomenal and I think he's really doing this story justice. And as always, really happy with the writer, Brian Michael Bendez. He's doing a great job too. So anyways, I'll leave it at that. There are a lot of little tie-ins here and there, most of which aren't essential, but it does add a little bit here and there along the way if you're interested in reading those. So that's it. I'll do a video on issue number five when it comes out. But thank you guys for watching me in this review. Be sure to check out my Patreon site, my social media sites, my websites, and everything else out there. Peace, love, namaste, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.